all right what's going on YouTube in this video I am going to be showing you how to update your Hackintosh which is on 10.9.0 to 10.9.1 now this is only a Delta update which means there is not going to be any combo update for this I don't know why Apple's done this but this means that because it's only a Delta update it means that you have to update from your Mac App Store so that is the only way to do it so just to make sure make sure you do a backup before you do any updates on your Hackintosh because you do not want anything to go wrong such as you get a kernel panic after updating this shouldn't be a problem anyway because it is only a Delta update so it's just gonna fix minor bugs and all of that but just to be on a safe side make sure you do make a backup of your Hackintosh system and also just if you want quickly do some research on Tony Mac x86 just to make sure that your Hackintosh build will be compatible with 10.9.1 so let's get to it all right guys so as you can see we are on my desktop now I will show you that I am on version 10.9 now as I probably said before this is for a Z77 DS3H motherboard Hackintosh because I know it works for this properly um, if you do have any other Hackintosh just make sure that you check and do your research most probably on Tony Mac x86 website they would probably tell you if your Hackintosh will be compatible with 10.9.1 as it's not a major update it shouldn't be a problem and because it's not a combo update you're just gonna have to download it from the app store so as you can see OS X update 10.9.1 all you have to do make sure before you do this back up your stuff because you never know when stuff can go wrong although that your computer or your Hackintosh has gone through all the previous updates on uh, Mountain Lion without any problems at all this is Mavericks although it's not a big update just make sure you do do a backup because even though you might think it's gonna be good you never know what can go wrong so anyways what you want to do is just hit update and then fingers crossed you just want to click restart now I am just going to stop my screen recording here and I will come back once it has updated so I'll be back to you all right guys so as you can see I am back on my desktop now I just want to show you on about this Mac I am now on version 10.9.1 and I just want to mention this update was just so successful I did not have to do anything um, there was no problems that I ran into it just successfully downloaded and installed and it was very quick it was literally within one and a half minutes it downloaded update and installed it so I guess it was a very small file I guess that's why there's not a combo update and it's just a Delta update of the App Store anyways as you can see 10.9.1 and all those Hackintosh users you probably know this when you update your Hackintosh you always will most probably lose your audio driver that is not a problem at all all you have to do is go to Tony Max website which I will have a link in the description download Multibeast which I have right here um, just download the latest version for Mavericks all you have to do go driver depending on which Hackintosh you have got you just have to select whichever driver it is go to select it build and then you want to hit install I've already installed it so I've actually got my Hackintosh fully successfully running on 10.9.1 so all those Hackintosh users I hope I helped you update to 10.9.1 so thanks for watching please comment subscribe and rate and please 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 just smash that like button down below also try favorite this video and also try to share this video because it does help my channel a lot so once again thanks for watching please comment subscribe and rate